So I'm here staying at the La Brenda Rose Aquapark and Hotel Complex in Morocco. So I thought I'd come on in, give you a little tour around the hotel and the facilities. So let's go in and have a little look. So let's go in, here's the entrance. Got a couple of groovy statues here. I don't know if that's possibly Michael Jackson or what. So you come in, over there is the reception. This lifts round to the right. And that's where you can book stuff over there. And you've got all this seating area in the middle, it goes round. Here's the view from the upstairs. That big round circle as we'll come around downstairs. I'm up on the fourth floor, so that's the top floor. Quite a nice view, this is in the central lobby. This has got some stairs upstairs. There. Here you got your bars. I'll show you a bit better later. I don't think this door's open here. We've got a piano, nice bar in there where you can watch your football. I watched the football last night. In there is the restaurant where you get your buffet style meals. I'll show you that a bit later in the video. Here's just a little shop on the side. So let's go through and look at the pool area. I filmed it quite early so it's not too busy. Over there is the bar. Get drinks all day long. Which you need in this weather. There's the pool. Massive great big pool. I'll quickly show you through to that little bar where I said you can watch the football. Go this way a bit. There's the doors that was locked over there. You come through. It's nice and cool in here in the day if you want to come in and watch the football or that. Have a big screen up there. I see it's still clean at the moment, it's still early because I wanted to get in early before all well, the crowds started. So let's go back and have a look at the aqua palm and all the other facilities they have here. There's the back of the restaurant now, outdoor seating. Beds. Oh, so you get down early, put your towels on. It's all be German. Right, if you go this way, we're going through to the aqua park now. Go through here to the aqua park. Aqua park. We've got a separate restaurant over there, but that's uh, not in the all inclusive part, so you have to pay for that. I'm trying to keep kids off the films and stuff. So there might be a few funny angles here. I might not be able to show it all the aqua park because it might be closed. But it is closed, I don't know it's closed at the moment, but through there. Oh look, there's a little birdie. There's a gym in there if you can see it. Fully equipped gym, go through the spa to get to that. A little birdie taking shade. Let's leave him in peace. So it was 43 degrees here yesterday, so it does get kind of warm, but lucky enough the actual air conditioning ain't too bad in the rooms. Actually slept pretty well. Up here, let's quickly show you this. I'm still cleaning this stuff at the moment. Oh, got a hose pipe across my way. Then there's the Aqua Park. Up here, they've got a kids' club. 
and they've got a little play park for the kids. Let's go back down here. Sounds to kill me with a hose. Down here we've got a spa. Spa opening times, yeah. And in there we've got a got an indoor swimming pool. There's the indoor swimming pool. And you do like massages, hot stone massages. Apparently it's supposed to be quite good. I think uh, I think if I've got a picture of uh prices, they do like a two hour session for 800 dirham, which is about 80 pound, I think it's if you basically take off a zero, I can't get through that way. Let's go back and see if we can get a little look at the aqua park. All right, here's the aqua park. It's actually all closed up at the moment, which is probably the best time to film it because I'm really filming families on their holidays. Got this little child section here, this is ideal. They have all water running, that big bucket fills up with water and splashes down every so often, which the kids love. A couple of little slides, a little tube one and a little open air one. Over there they have a spa and even goes, you can swim up to the bar from that pool, uh, spa if you can see it. And of course there's all your big slides and flumes. I thought the green one would be the fastest, but it, it's not really. I think like the open air, like the pink and blue ones are more faster. You can get up quite a good speed. I was on it yesterday having great days fun now. Anyway, that's a little tour. I'll uh, show you my uh, room next and show you a bit in the old um, buffet. I, I think I filmed yesterday the lunch buffet. So give you a rough idea and a little taster. Right, so this is a quick video of the room. Just thought I'd show you one of the rooms here. The Brunda Rose. Let's go in. This is where I'm staying, 448. Quite lucky because we've got a balcony straight out on outside overlooking the pool. How nice is that? Right, let's go back to the room. So let's go in the room. Lovely little room. On the right, you've got your safe here, free, you don't have to pay for it. So you just have to type in your number. Obviously, excuse the mess with the clothes. On your right, you've got a sliding door bathroom. Here's your toilet facilities. Over this side, you've got a shower, you get some towels up there. Shower's quite good. The only thing is, when you, it's really powerful, but it leaks over there, it leaks over. So I had to mop it all up there when I had a shower this morning. Right, so you've got all your wardrobe parts there. In this room, I think a lot of rooms are the same. You've got a twin beds, some lamps. And when you sit here, this is the third bed. When you sit here, it's really cool because the air conditioning blows from up there. It's a really cool place to sit. You've got a TV, but being English, the only English channel on there is Sky Sports News. So, oh, and actually I was quite surprised that we've actually got a nice fridge, which is a wonderful addition. So all in all, I'm quite pleased with this room. Got a little thing out here. Sometimes if you want to go up there early, it can get a bit noisy because they got they play the music over by the pool and that. As you can see, there's all the flumes or water slides, whatever you want to call them. Yeah, in general, I'm quite pleased with this room. So this is where you go for your buffet. 
I just thought I'd show you a little bit of the food, although it's quite busy, this is a lunchtime buffet. The dinner is a little bit different, so I just thought I'd do a little video of the lunch. Just go and have a little look at what they've got on offer. There it is. It's a little bit busy here at the moment. You get your, like, your little fries and stuff there. Your pastas, roast beef. There's all your fresh produce and stuff. I had a lovely beef tagine dinner and it was lovely the beef just melted in your mouth it's absolutely gorgeous if they got that on tonight I'm going to be having some more of that I just want to see actually I want to see a lamb tagine I wonder what tagine is they usually cook these sort of things in this like a clay sort of pot look at that oh that looks lovely vegetables in the cooking with the sashimi uh, let's have a look actually the cakes on the lunch time seem to be a lot better than the cakes on the dinner time some lovely cakes there oh that one looks nice I tried that one didn't have that last yesterday I want to try that one they nice biscuits and stuff The staff, uh, actually I can not complain one little bit about the staff. Last night, we were feeling a bit peckish and we went in there and said, have you got any little snacks? And they bought our whole table full of food for us. That was amazing. This is like 11 o'clock at night and the, the restaurant was closed. So it was really nice of them. They couldn't, couldn't do enough for you. I'm really impressed with the staff to be fair. So that's our little look at the buffet. This is the lunch buffet. The dinner's buffet is slightly different. Obviously, it's not typical sort of English foods. But you go for like the, the nice chicken, beef, or lamb dishes. Oh, and they've, they've got your rice and your fries. So, highly recommended. Delicious. You might get bored of it by the end of the week, but in general, kids still got their fries. So that's that little look around here. Here as well, you've got all your local breads. I tried some of that yesterday. It's lovely, and they have even more breads at dinner time. Like obviously, local made like a sourdough type bread, some of them. Really nice, a whole can of breads. In the mornings when you have your breakfast you get your coffee over there, but unfortunately the coffee doesn't not open during the day. But I'm not sure if I'm gonna show you our breakfast menu, but if I do I'll let you all obviously see it in this video. So I've got this little bit of food here, I'm gonna give it a little try, just thought I'll give you a show. That's cauliflower, so just in spices. This is aubergine. And that's a bit of meat. Oh my god. That is so tender. That is beautiful. Oh, that is beautifully tender. That meat. Got some peppers. It's not. I always imagine Moroccan food to be more spicy, but. It's probably dumbed down a bit for the tourists. That's beautiful. Lovely, lovely um, flavoured potatoes. All the beef I've tried, chicken, beef, I haven't seen no lamb yet, maybe that's later on in the week. But it's so tender, it just melts in your mouth. 
So here I am with plate number two. We've got some beef in peppercorn sauce. I'm gonna give this a go. That is lovely. That is really lovely. This is a bit of fish, white fish. Oh, that, I'm good. Oh. Okay, third and final plate. Dessert. I'm most likely looking forward to trying this. So, let's give this a little go. Oh, yeah, I knew that was lemony. That's, that's what I like. Let's try this one. A little bit dry, that one. Yeah, that one's a little bit dry. This is just a basic sponge with cream. Is that okay? Yeah, this is my favourite. It's very nice. Hi. Okay, Poppy wants to give her a review of the cakes. So, which one are you trying first, Poppy? I think I'm going to try this um, lemon one. Thing. Just a little bit of it. <laughs> no. Not for you. Not for you. You're not a great lemon, lemon lover. That's uh, well, I won't go. That, I, I really enjoyed that one. To be fair. Anyway. So this what is. This? What's this one? I've got nuts on top. Is that? Uh, yeah. Like it's sort of like a brownie thing. Oh, brownie. You like it. your brownies, don't you? a little bit dry from my own personal taste. A little bit. A little bit, yeah. But, try your third and final one, which is... Um, um, it's like, um, it's like a bread, basically, but it has like cream It's alright with the cream. Like, it like a whole cake, and it had like cream in the middle of it. Mm. And which one's your favourite then? Opinion of the cakes. <laughs> Where she can talk again because she's building stuff in her face. <laughs> so, I hope you enjoyed that. That was the La Branda Rose Aqua Park Hotel. We've had fun here this week, so come along and check it out. I've really rated the staff are really friendly. Reception is not always that friendly, they're not the friendliest ones, but the people who serve you in the restaurants and bars and that, they're really friendly. And uh hope that's interesting and thanks for watching.